The great marriages are partnerships. It can't be a great marriage without being a partnership. In terms of my marriage, you know, falling in love with my husband was by far the best thing that's ever happened to me. My husband has made me laugh, wiped my tears, hugged me tight, watched me succeed, seen me fail, kept me strong. My husband is a promise that I will have a friend forever. Husband and wife relationships are like the relationship of Tom and Jerry. Though they are teasing and fighting, but can't live without each other. My husband is my best friend, my greatest support, my biggest comfort, my strongest motivation, my truest smile, my deepest love, my favorite, my forever. He has me. Entirely. A husband and wife may disagree on many things but they must absolutely agree on this, to never, ever give up. There is no such cozy combination as man and wife. A successful marriage requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. A great marriage is not when the perfect couple comes together. It is when an imperfect couple learns to enjoy their differences. Never marry the one you can live with, marry the one you cannot live without. A good marriage is one which allows for change and growth in the individuals and in the way they express their love. Marriage is not about age, it's about finding the right person. Experts on romance say for a happy marriage there has to be more than a passionate love. For a lasting union, they insist, there must be a genuine liking for each other. Which, in my book, is a good definition for friendship. A great marriage isn't something that just happens. It's something that must be created. So it's not going to be easy. It's going to be really hard. We're going to have to work at this every day. But I want to do that because I want you. I want all of you, forever, every day. You and me. Every day. True love stands by each other's side on good days and stands closer on bad days. Love is not weakness. It is strong. Only the sacrament of marriage can contain it. The secret to a happy marriage is if you can be at peace with someone within four walls, if you are content because the one you love is near to you, either upstairs or downstairs, or in the same room, and you feel that warmth that you don't find very often, then that is what love is all about. Marriage is not a noun, it's a verb. It isn't something you get. It's something you do. It's the way you love your partner every day. It is not a lack of love, 
but a lack of friendship that makes unhappy marriages. Don't ever stop dating your wife and don't ever stop flirting with your husband. Marriage stands the test of times when both you and your spouse work towards making things better. And we are tested the most when we face adversities. If you can sail through the adversities as one, as a team, then you have won half the battle. Marriage, to women as to men, must be a luxury, not a necessity, an incident of life, not all of it. A perfect marriage is just two imperfect people who refuse to give up on each other. To love is nothing. To be loved is something. But to be loved by the person you love is everything. May this marriage be full of laughter, our every day in paradise. Marriage, ultimately, is the practice of becoming passionate friends. A good marriage is the union of two good forgivers. A good marriage is a contest of generosity. Marriage is like watching the color of leaves in the fall, ever-changing and more stunningly beautiful with each passing day.